Hello, my dear friends. Good evening. Charlie, welcome back. Good evening, Proven. Hello. How are you? Well, definitely I'm better than, than Friday. I have a, an emergency, a familiar emergency. But everything, oh. it's okay. Yes, yes. It, no, it was oh. not mine. Mm -hmm. But uh, thank you for your comprehension. And well, you had a uh, kind of vacation. Descansar un poquito, ¿verdad? Mira la cara de Andrea, me llega. <laughs> ¿Verdad, Andreita? Mm, esa cara. Okay. So, uh, thanks for, for asking. Gracias por preguntar. Uh, but, but everything okay. Okay, everything in order. Um, I was able to connect maybe, but kind of late. Sí, estaba casi por... Bueno, iba a estar disponible para conectarme un poquito más tarde, pero, pero, pero no, ¿verdad? Entonces... Ah, se decidió que mejor no. Así que ustedes descansaron. You have a Friday, at least one free Friday. Al fin tuvieron un viernes libre. ¿Verdad, Charlie? ¿Verdad, Andreita? Yes. yes. Okay. Did you enjoy it? ¿Lo, ¿Lo disfrutaron? ¿Lo aprovecharon? Yes, I slept early. Really, okay, good. So the next day you were like ready, right? Yes. Yes, I know well. I guess we all uh, needed uh, like um, a, a relaxing time. Uh, we need that to stop, to stop the, the, this uh, continuing classes. Así que ahora que, que, que pues ya, ya recargaron, you reloaded some energy. Ya estamos ya por finalizar. Remember after this, we're having uh, six classes. Okay, six classes and we're finished. Then you can sleep after that. You will sleep earlier. ¿Verdad, Andrita? Van a dormir más temprano. Charlie, you're going to, to have more time for your family and all those. All that. Yes. Or to do whatever you want. Okay. So nice, Andrita. Tell me, uh, how was your your your, your Monday? Uh, it's Monday, teacher. I it's know. a very, very difficult day. Yes, 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 yes. It's a very difficult day, in, but in mm -hmm. special for the traffic. Uh what what is the worst day for the traffic? Monday or Friday? Both. Both the same. Wow. Well, I mean, as I live here in Planet de Renderos, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, believe it, it's horrible. This is a this is a, a disaster. Yeah, so so. If you want to come to Planet de Renderos, please, I recommend you to come early, vengan temprano, and be aware, sean conscientes that, be aware that maybe you're going to, going, you're going to go back late, maybe un poquito tarde, or if you want to, to, to what, uh, to spend the time on the traffic, I don't recommend it. But if you come in more, in motorcycle, in a bike, it's different, okay, it, it's kind of different. Ah, depends. Because I I reading este atrás, teacher, ya lo voy a correr cómo se dice. Back. Uh -huh. Of the cars. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Back of the cars. Okay. So uh -huh. you, you, you don't you don't advance quickly, no sobrepasa. No. Okay. You're very responsible. No. Pero Charlie se me hace que es algo rebellious, <laughs> como cocolito cuando salía ahí con. Oh, oh, no. You are careful. In, Very cuidadoso. Uh, but uh, I I try uh, inside. No, no, no inside. Inside between, your way. Between the cars. Ah, okay. You don't like. Between the cars. But I I drive uh, responsible. Yes. You are I responsible. I never I never had a okay a crash. Yes. Oh, really? Congratulations. That's good because most of the oh, most, most of the riders have had uh, some accidents or crashes because they are. I have. Hmm? I have five years driving and I never have and, a crash. And no accident. So good for you. Well, that that's fine. Care is. Uh huh. In the beginning, uh, I drive. Uh, I drove uh, same Andreita uh, behind behind the car. Behind the car. But uh, uh, with the time, I 
I learned to to drive uh, between the cars. Mm -hmm. Okay, carefully, uh, carefully. Okay, that that's good. So here we have careful is when you are responsible and careless is when te vale. Okay, when you you don't take care of things. Eh, careless es descuidado, eh, es así que una, una, una persona que, que realmente no es nada responsable. And careful is the opposite. Careful es cuidadoso, como responsable. Okay, so those are uh, like uh, words that maybe we can use. Marlon, good evening, my friend. Good evening. Okay, Marlon, tell me what did you do on Friday? Did you take advantage of the time? Uh, yes. <laughs> you, you relax. Uh, you spend time with your family. Sleep. Uh, did you sleep early? Friday, teacher. Yeah, on Friday we didn't have classes. So that's why I, I'm, I'm asking you that. That. Uh, what did you do on Friday? Of course, uh, I uh, I had to work. Really? Actually. Okay, yes. so but you took advantage always, always working here in my house. Uh -huh. Here in my house. Yes. Okay. So you advanced, advanced uh, related to, to your work. Okay. Yes, but, teacher. I have to. I have so, to. Yes, you had to. Well, but mm. at least you took advantage. Okay. And you had that advance. Well, that, that's fine. Teacher. If Porque no vieron clase. Yo realmente no me pude conectar. No, I have I have some problems, some, some familiar problems. Tuve una dificultad de familiares ahí. Me decía raro que no me habían llamado a regañarme. No, 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 no. Tuvimos esa dificultad y es por eso que eh, yo solicité, bueno, que tal vez podría conectarme un poquito más tarde, pero íbamos a entrar en, en dificultades con el tema de, del tiempo de conexión, ¿verdad? Entonces no para no afectarlos a ustedes y todo mejor se movió un día, pero sí. Realmente nunca, nunca me pasa eso, ¿verdad? Ni nada. O sea, a mí me gusta siempre terminar los, los días y todo y no pedir eh, permiso ni nada por, por, el, por el tema de, de cumplimiento de horas, ¿verdad? Ok. Sí, sí, disculpa del caso, ¿verdad? Por todos, ¿verdad? Pero... Bueno, a mí realmente me, me benefició, teacher. Eso, eso les iba a decir. I, I was going to say that. that nobody uh, got angry. Na, nadie se enojó. <laughs> Quieren este viernes también, ¿verdad? <laughs> ok. Okay. Yes, but, but everything okay, my friend. So we are. Yo about... les iba a dar clases y no quisieron. Tú sí, pero clases de qué, Susi? A ver. <laughs> Un poco de mezcla, algo para ya viene. Ah, ya. Yeah. DJ <laughs> dice que DJ. Okay. Excelente. Va eso sí. Ya no, va, vamos a ver eh, si, si nos reunimos, Susi, pa, para para ver ese tipo de clases, okay. Vamos a hacer tu, mini tutoriales. Okay, so, uh, okay, let's see who else. A ver, Susi, what did you do on Friday? Tell me. Uh, sincerely, I, I fell asleep. Wow. Early. Yeah, really good, right? So the next day you were 100% with energy. Yeah, of course. Good, good for you, yes. So everybody took advantage. I, I like to hear that. Thank you. Mercy, good evening. Mercy. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hello. How was your Friday? The last Friday. Uh, going to resting, the party? No. To the disco? Resting no. at home. Resting at home. Okay. Resting in high school cuando nos decían, no van a haber clase. Sí, todo, yeah. <laughs> no, pues sí. Sí, eso sí creo que hasta se había planchado el pelo y ya estaba lista. Anyway, so nice. Good for you. Jasmine, good evening. Good evening. Hello, how, how was your, your last Friday? Tell me. Uh, baby Zoe and I, we are, uh, we was going to the- We were going, mm -hmm. we were going. We were going uh, to the Hospital de Sacamil. Ah, really? And... For the exam of the, of the, uh, of the ear, oh, yes. the baby, uh, the, the baby's exam, right? Auditivo. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. And she was very good. Okay, exam. so the results are okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, well, I'm glad to hear that. Just yes. well, 
that, that's awesome. Very nice. So you took advantage <laughs> of that. Perfect, Jasmine. Thank you. And here we have some other. Uh, what about uh, Beatriz? Maybe you are on your way. We have um, Elsa. Okay, uh, I guess uh, we are about to, to start now. Okay, um, this is the class number 14. It means that we have six classes, six classes left. No, quedan seis classes, okay? So, um, Simple past information questions. We're going to have a review of, of simple past using did and regular and irregular verbs, okay? So, but first, just tell me how many traffic accidents have you seen? Just tell me the number, the number. How many traffic accidents have you seen? It depends, okay? It depends because uh, it is not necessary to be in the accident bus, but uh, to be like observer, ser observador, or be like uh, uh, be testifying, estar como puede ser el testigo, okay? So, or witness, witness, que es eh, testigo, eh, o como te, sí, lo es como testificar, presenciar, eh, watch, um, let me see, I'm going to put this, okay, witness, and let's see, Elsa, good evening. Hi, teacher. Good Hello. evening. Hello. Hello. How are you, Elsa? Uh, fine, thank you. Ese suspiro. Ajá, ajá. Ánimo. ¿Cómo se dice para tomar ánimo? <laughs> cherry. You have to cherry. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, yeah. tell me, how, how many traffic accidents have you seen? Just tell me the number. One traffic accident, two traffic accidents. Ten, eleven, sixteen hours. Really? Yes. Wow. Okay. Okay. Ten or eleven. Okay. Let, let's keep it on, on that. And now yes. let's. Okay. We're going to talk about it later. Edgar. Hello, Edgar. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Okay. Tell me how many traffic accidents have you seen? Two traffic accidents, three, four. Did you have seen? Remember, remember two. Only two. Okay. Only two. Yes. Okay. Okay. Well, nice. So here we have the contrary, the opposite, two and eleven. Let's see, <laughs> Jasmine. How many car crashes, traffic accidents? I don't remember. You don't. You don't really remember. No. No. <laughs> no one. Maybe no one. Okay. No. In the okay. Troncal del Norte. Well, that's a very famous highway. That's a very, a very famous highway, yes. But I don't remember I was there. Really? Okay. And remember that we have, we have um, car crash. Car crash is un choc, okay? But run over is atropellar, okay? Well, for example, a person is walking through the street and there came, there came, there came a, a, a car or a motorcycle or a bus and can hit that person, can run over, okay? So um, car crash is when two cars or one car and one motorcycle hit each other, or it can be a bus, it can be a trailer, it can be, okay, whatever. Uh, Susie, what about you? How many? Uh, I I have I have been witness only three or four traffic accidents. I'm sorry, three or four. Yep. Okay. Okay. Well, uh, we we are increasing the number. Uh, let's listen out. Uh, listen to Eden Nilsson. Eden, hello there. Hi, teacher. Hello. Good evening. Okay, Eden. We are talking about traffic accidents. How many have you seen? Uh, if I uh, was in the in the street in the highway at the moment, or I was passing. Okay, but yeah, the, tell me the number. The number, how many car crashes or accidents? Exactly, happened? I don't remember you don't because remember. Hmm? in the in the Troncal del Norte, 
is so much accurate. Yes, it's very dangerous. It's similar to to Los Chorros. The last. That's another highway. That yes, is. yes. The last one that I saw, mm -hmm. uh, two motorcycles are involved. Involved. Mm -hmm. Involved. Involved. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Good. Well, thanks. Thanks for 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 uh, telling. Um, let's see. And uh, who else? And uh, Carito. Good evening, Carito. Are you are you okay? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Carito. Okay. Tell me, how many uh, traffic accidents have you seen? Um, more or less. Um, nine or nine. ten. Nine. Yes. Wow. That, a lot of, of, of accidents. Okay. Yes. And the Boulevard del Ejército is... Yes, is, um, that's another dangerous and dangerous yes. uh, road. Okay, thank you, Carito. Uh, Mercy, what about you? Okay, in this year, only three. <laughs> no, no, nothing more. Okay, in no, this year, no three. But what about okay. in your whole life? Uh, car crash, creo yo que okay, car crash. Así, uh -huh. al paso, lo que me he logrado ver, pero así de presencial, oh. no. Okay, ah, oh, okay, maybe for, from a side, de, de, de lejito. Okay, uh, let's listen now to Kevin. Good evening, Kevin. Good evening, teacher. Okay, Kevin, tell me how many traffic accidents have you seen? Uh, three. I Just three. three. Okay. Well, few. So I see the focus. Okay. Very nice. Good for you. Now let's listen to Marlon. How many, Marlon? Um, uh, today or? No, no. Today. Wow. No, I mean in your whole life. Uh, how many uh, traffic accidents have you seen? In the past, lot, in the present? I have, I have, I have seen a lot of of traffic traffic accidents, teacher. Okay, I maybe more, more many, than fifteen. Yes. Wow. So much more. Wow. Yes. Wow. Yes, I have. I have seen uh, car crashes, and I have seen uh, runs runs over. Yes, runs over. Mm -hmm. See, mm -hmm. atropellos. Yes. Atropellos. Oh. Uh, well, I I I I saw one run over. Uh, but it had been passed. Ya había, ya había sucedido. Ya había sucedido. Okay. Mm -hmm. There were the, the, the victims. Mm -hmm. It has already yes. passed. It has already passed. Mm -hmm. It has already passed. Que era witness teacher. Eh, presenciar, verdad? Presenciar. Presenciar como ser testigo de algo, okay? Por eso los testigos de Jehová se, se llaman witness. Mm -hmm. Eh, Jehová <laughs> Witness. Ajá, no sé, Jehová Witness. Uh -huh. Por eso aparece la J y la W. Si se dan cuenta. Entonces. Ah, ok. That's it. Yes. Hasta ahora lo entiendo. Bueno, convertite, Marlon. Ok, so, hey, thanks. Hey, <laughs> Mucho me pide, teacher. Ok, eh, well, Marlon uh, has seen a lot of traffic uh, uh, accidents. Let's listen to eh, Andreita. Tell me, how many? Maybe three or four. Three or four. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Uh, there are a few. Uh, Maritza, good evening. Good evening. Okay, Maritza, we're talking about how many traffic accidents have you seen? Uh, I don't remember. You're maybe but one. But I think uh, five. Mm -hmm. Okay, five. Possible. Okay, I guess five, it's like a normal kind of normal uh, number. And Carmencita, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello, everything okay? Yeah. Yeah, teacher. Okay, nice. How many traffic accidents have you seen, Carmencita? I have seen many traffic many. accidents. More than seven, more than 10? Uh, no, teacher. Uh, 20 or 20. more. Okay. Yes, teacher. I guess you Fuerte and... Fuerte <laughs> uh, But okay. I'm not, I'm not at the 
the moment of the accident, no. After, after the accident. Yes, yes. Okay. Yes, that, that that's not so good to <laughs> to witness to see, uh, especially when they run over. Cuando han habido atropellos, they run over. It is very terrible because of the blood that I, well, I have seen some others. Okay. Ah, so, también he visto terrible de esos de accidentes. Yes. De, de ver en, en la carretera untada mm -hmm. la gente terrible. Ah, yes. Carmen. Thank you. Bájate, <laughs> creo que te estás desestresando aquí, mira. Okay, thanks, Carmencita. Just to uh, tell you, highway es carretera, como highway to hell de ACDC. Ok, entonces highway es carretera, pero freeway, freeway es eh, como una autopista amplia. No, freeway el grupo de acá. <laughs> ok, so, bueno, quizá, ¿verdad? Pero, bueno, that's another thing. Ok, uh, so, in this case, uh, the freeways may be like, well, like a, a, a really big highway. Es como una carretera, pero, pero grandísima, de cuatro o cinco carriles, eh, posiblemente, or more. Uh, in some other countries that there are some freeways, okay? But here in Salvador, we mainly have highway, okay? So um, he, he have run over, que es atropellar, car crash, es a eh, choque, es un choque, eh, principalmente de vehículos. And watch, mirar, witness, presenciar, o uh, testiguar, verdad? Se, eh, se estar presente. Okay, in, uh, in this case, we're talking about accidents. Okay, so to start um, going to, here we have some, well, I'm going to check the attendance list. So please say hi, hello, if you are there. Ana Mercedes, hello. Present. Thanks, uh, Andrea. Hi. Hi, <laughs> thank you, Charlie. Present teacher. Nice, Carmen. Present teacher. Thank you, Claudia. Present. Oh, nice, Claudia. Carito. It's me. It's you, Marita. Present. Okay, fine. Diana, are you there again? All right. Uh, Ede, Ede Nilsson, hello. Present. Hi, nice. Edgar. I'm here. Sir Elsa, hello. Present teacher. Thank you. Damari, no, I have not seen Damari. Helen, I guess Helen is on her way. She's not. Present teacher. Thank you. Kevin. Present teacher. Thanks. Manuel. No. Manuel. Present. Ah, oh, well, hello, Manuel. Okay. Hello. Hey, Marlon. Present. Thank you, Susie. I'm here. You're there. Jasmine and Bill. Present. Thank you. Okay. So we're going to uh, check this vocabulary. Uh, telephone phrasal verbs. Here we have some uh, phrasal verbs that are very common. Maybe you know some of them. Here we have hung up, hung up. It's to end a conversation. Hang on is to wait for a short time. Y hold on to wait for a short time. Those are synonyms. Some synonyms. So a veces dice hold on, but hold on. Sometimes you can say it in a in a conversation, in a real conversation, one by one, face to face person, and you can say, okay, hold on, hold on, okay, calm, relax, como cálmate, relájate, espera, okay. But uh, talking about uh, telephone uh, vocabulary, hold on is to wait for a short time. I mean, thirty seconds, fifteen seconds, or one minute, okay, but no more than that. Call back is uh, to return the call, okay? Or call back again. Speak up is to be importante. When a person says speak up, hablen más fuerte, okay? And here, or you can say speak louder. I'm going to, to write it here. Speak louder is habla más fuerte, similar to speak up, okay? Um, Pick up, ya se recuerda que pick up es levantar, ¿verdad? Recuerda, so pick up is to answer uh, a call. Se dan cuenta que pick, pick up es, bueno, un phrasal verb que se utiliza bastante para muchas cosas. Cut off, cut off o cut off, como R, cut off. To interrupt a conversation, put through, through, through. Uh, to connect one phone to another. 
for a person, uh, for example, the secretaries, they put through a call. Ellos pon, conectan una conversación con, con eh, o pasan la conversación to, to their boss, maybe. Sometimes they do that. Break up is to become inaudible when maybe the telephone or the signal is failing, is having some problem. So uh, that becomes inaudible, como que no se puede escuchar bien, como que el sonido va. And get through is to succeed in speaking, okay? When you are uh, speaking very well, when you are having like um, no problems, okay? So you get through is when you, your conversation is nice, your call is perfect, okay? And hablando de también con la, cuando le dicen listen up, es pon atención, okay? Speak up, es hablar muy fuerte, pero listen up es pon atención, okay? O escuchen eso, que es más importante. We're going to start with Charlie and then Andrea. Please. Pick one. Select one and pronounce it. Okay, hang up. Good, Andrea, mercy. Break up. Good, uh, mercy, Carmen. Hang up. Okay, Carmen, Jasmine. Put through. Good, Jasmine, Marlon. Break up. Okay, Marlon, Maritza. Get through. Thank you, Maritza. Claudia. Hold on. Nice. Claudia, Carito. Speak up. Good, Carito. Bea. Call back. Nice. Bea, Susi. Okay, if Bea is not available, let's listen to Susi. Then Edgar. Listen up. Good, Edgar, Manuel. Call back. Good, Manuel, Elsa. Good off. Nice. Elsa, Kevin. Break up. Okay. Kevin, Helen. Hold on. Nice. Helen, Carmen, Sita. Speak up. Okay. Carmen, Ellen, Nelson. Hold back. Okay. Thank you. So this is part of the vocabulary. And we're having a worksheet related to but the simple past or the past simple, remember that the last time we have some problems. So here we have an example uh, related to the irregular verbs. Okay, she ate dinner, you ate dinner. Ate is el pasado de eat, que es comer. It's an irregular verb. And as you can see, he didn't, you didn't, she didn't eat dinner. Uh, the verb doesn't change, okay? The verb is normal. And for the question is the same. The verb doesn't change. El verbo no cambia, right? Because we are using did is uh, the auxiliar and it helps to change or to transform the sentence. Here we have affirmative, negative, and questions. Question, okay? Affirmative, negative, and questions. We can have another example. For example, cook. Cook is cocinar, it's and it is a regular verb. She cooked, con Ede, cooked dinner. Oh, she cooked uh, pizza. Uh, she didn't cook pizza. Uh, did she cook pizza? Okay, so that's it. And remember that we are using did. It's como el verbo do, but in the past, okay? And for the future, we have will. Esos son los equivalentes, okay? So remember, remember that in affirmative, we change the verb, cambiamos el verbo en afirmativo, but just in, in affirmative, in negative, not necessary to change the verb, in question, not necessary to change the verb, okay? Didn't is, uh, is the construction of did not, que es lo mismo. Okay, now that you are ready, están listos para tener éxito en la vida, eh, tenemos acá. Questions uh, was, uh, I'm sorry, uh, yes, questions was, were. Recuerden que was y were es el pasado del be. Okay, was es para los singulares y were es para los plurales. Okay. Um, let's start in this time with Mercy. Okay, Mercy. Pick one. Uh, recuerden que estamos utilizando questions. Estamos utilizando las preguntas when, who, how much, how long, how, where, why. How many? Okay, Mercy, and then we go with Jasmine. Number eight, the okay. How many ducks? Dogs, uh -huh. Dogs were there. Perfect. Okay, now let's see uh, 
Jasmine and Claudia. When were you born? Good. Claudia and Maritza. Claudia, we can't hear you. Sorry. Sorry, teacher. Problem. Why were she lounging? Uh, where? Hmm? Uh -huh. uh, the, no, la otra, la otra. The the other. Why? Yes. Ah, uh -huh. why? why? Why were? Mm, by, where es para plurales. Ajá, pero she es singular. So. Uh -huh. Entonces, was. Yes, why was she laughing? Laughing, como con laughing. F. Thank ah, you. laughing. Okay. Yes, eh, laugh, eh, siempre que vean una G y una H se pronuncia como F. Ok, eh, for example, eh, tenemos esto. Ok, cough. Ok, and there are some more examples. Mm, like, sí, tenemos esto. Tenemos tough. Ok, cough, tough, y esto que es reír, love. Todo que tenga FH, ese fonema es una F. GH, perdón, GH es como F. Cough, tough, love. Ok, cough, tough, love, cough, tough, love. Así, sencillo, simple. Ok, and now let's listen to Carito. And then Kevin. Ok, number two. Who was the winner? Who, excellent, Carito. Who was the winner? Thank you, Kevin. And then we go with Helen. Number six. Hmm? Where were the penguins? Penguins, yes. Yeah. Where were the penguins? Se escucha raro, where were, pero así es, okay? Okay, where were the penguins? And Helen, and then we go with... Charlie. Number five. Mm -hmm. uh, who were? Okay, the, can you read it, complete the sentence, please? How? How? Mm -hmm. Where? The mm -hmm. what? Mm -hmm. It's singular. Hello. Uh, entonces sería, what? Yes, how was? Okay. How was the weather? Thank you. Okay, Charlie, and finally, after Charlie, we're having uh, Edgar. Okay, Charlie. Okay, how long, how long were they in Spain? Yes, how long, eso significa cuánto tiempo. How long were they in Spain? Mm -hmm. And another question could it be, how long were you with the doctor? How, how long were you in the meeting? ¿Cuánto estuviste en la reunión? Okay. How long was the trip? ¿Cuánto duró el viaje? Okay, so those are examples. Thank you, Charlie. And finally, finally, Edgar, how much? Uh, how much was the coat? Perfect. Coat, yes. Nice, Edgar, perfect. Okay, now here we have some examples of um, regular and irregular verbs. And for this one, we're going to start with Carmen and then Andrea. So uh, I need you to pick one of these numbers. And we're going okay. to just remember. Uh, relax, Carmen. Carmen <laughs> pero con todo. Yes, I like that uh -huh. attitude. Nice. Okay, so oh, remember. Dios. Okay, we're going to use affirmative, negative, or questions. Okay, here we have these examples. Okay. Let's follow this structure. Okay, Carmen, show time. Okay, number eight. Mm -hmm. uh, ¿Cómo se palabra? Suddenly, suddenly, uh, suddenly, suddenly de... significa de repente. Suddenly, mm -hmm. como la canción de Let It Be, tiene suddenly. All my suddenly, the animal jumper and bite. Y ahí vamos a usar siempre el was. Mm -mm. Aquí los verbos que están en, entre paréntesis. Carmencita, ¿te sabes el pasado de bite? No. <risa> Bit. Solo es ponerlo en pasado. Aquí te lo acabo de poner. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Mm, ok. The animal jumped and bit. Bit. Bit my, my hand. hand. 
it's an irregular. It's an irregular. Okay, thanks. Okay. Uh, we go now with um, who, who, who? Andrea and Susie. Number 15. 15. Okay. Se teacher? Unfortunately. Unfortunately. Un unfortunately. Five syllables. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. And four. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. I forgot to, to uh, brought my money. Okay. Mm -hmm. Proud. Aquí no, no eh, si se dan cuenta, lleva una GH, pero no se pronuncia como F porque lleva una T. Si no tuviera la T, sería Brough, ¿verdad? Pero sería Brough. Ok. Thank you. And so, CQ. Uh, number 12. And then Marlon. Ok. When I was 10 years old, I broke right teacher. No. Yes. Seguí tu corazón. I, I broke. Pero quita eso, ajá. Huh? My arm. Relax, relax. It, <laughs> it really, it, 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 it's really, 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 Caught all, okay. all three. All three of the bank robbers last week. Okay, uh, Marlon, do you remember what uh, is robbers? Eh, quiero ver, quiero ver. A lo, los que robaron. Ajá, los ladrones. O sea que todos los robertos son ladrones. Okay, yes. Robbers are ladrones. Robert Similar es to de, de, lo, lo, asaltante podría ser. Mm -hmm. ¿Cómo? Yes, yes, that's it. Mm -hmm. Ok, um, le voy a poner un ejemplo. Tenemos Thief y tenemos Rover. Thief es un ladrón eh, y a veces, I'm sorry, se le llaman así, que algunos de ustedes han sido, han sido víctimas de los pickpockets. Los pickpockets son los manos suaves. Although that when you are on the bus and you don't feel their hands and they took your wallet, they took your money, they took your cell phone, okay? And, and you don't feel anything. Entonces, los thieves pueden ser ladrones y también son, se le pueden llamar pickpockets, ¿verdad? Que se roban cosas cuando nadie lo ve. Pero rover, rover normalmente es quien tiene un arma y que va a saltar, okay? So that's like uh, the difference, but sometimes they are confused. A veces utilizo, he visto algunos diálogos que utilizan thief para también para el otro, but it is common that thief is when you go to the store and you take something, for example, in, su, in super selectos, when they take some things, so they are thieves, thieves, and robbers are the ones who have like a knife, a way, a way phone, they have a, a gun, okay, and pickpockets son los, eh, los que tienen manita de ángel, no sé si algunos han sido eh, víctimas de ellos, espero que no. Okay. Teacher. Yes. Y en la que dijo Susi, donde dice it really hurt, uh -huh. pero ahí estamos poniendo verbos, pero eh, hurt ahí no es verbo, ¿verdad? Yes, 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 yes. ¿Cómo no? Eh, no es no. herido. Sí, pero hurt es de los verbos como put, como hit, que no cambian. Es irregular y no cambia. Está en pasado. Mm. Ya, ya, Carmencita. Mm. Mm -hmm. yeah. It really hurt. Eso como dolió. Dice, when I was 10 years old, I broke my arm. Me quebré el, el, el brazo. Realmente mm -hmm. dolió. También está una canción que se llama Love Hearts. ¿Verdad? Que todos se la sí. pueden. Okay. ok. Thanks. Uh, who's next? Who's Charlie? Yes. No, Charlie. Um, number 10. Hmm? The... Right brothers, right brother, uh, like almost, almost. Oh, I have problem with the past yeah. there. Flu. And flu, flu, the oh. first airplane in, in 1903. 03, thank Yes, the right brothers. Yes, they were the ones that, uh, like, 
maybe invented the plane, the airplane. Okay, and now let's go with Elsa and then Manuel. Um, number nine. Okay, nine. What time it was? Was you? Mm -mm. Vamos a usar el que está aquí en paréntesis. The, the one that is in parentheses. Exactly. Do. Mm -hmm. But in the past is? Dos. Mm -mm. Do in the past is? Um, why no me acuerdo. Did. Did. Ah, sí, el que también. Yes, okay. Teacher, eh, ¿en don? No. Eh, okay, estamos. Es como hecho. Don. Yep, don. Ah, okay. El presente do, en pasado es did, en pasado a participio es don. ¿Cómo la pregunta? ¿Qué has hecho? What have you done? ¿Qué has hecho? ¿Ok? Entonces, don es hecho. Uh -huh. Pero did, uh, es el que estamos utilizando ahorita. ¿Ok? Este, ve. Did. ¿Ok? Es complicado. Sí, me di duro en la plataforma. Mm, ¿Y cuál estamos utilizando? Do. Don. Es que, de hecho, yo... Vaya, mire, he tratado de leer un poco el, ¿cómo es que se llama? El, el PDF que usted nos compartió y ahí me he ido guiando, pero yo no tenía claro eso porque en la plataforma nos pidió una tarea que pasemos los negativos a los positivos. Uh -huh. Entonces yo decía, ¿y cómo era Perica lo voy a hacer? Porque yo ponía el di, pero no es así, sino que solo tengo que hacer el, el verbo en pasado únicamente. Si es afirmativa, y no, sí. Y omit, ajá, si es afirmativa, por eso. Entonces yo siempre le ponía el di, el di, y yo, y yo de Perica para el di, pero no, ya, ya más o menos me quedó un poquito claro, pero sí estuvo complicado para mí, por lo menos. Ya vamos a hacer más ejercicios, oíste, Susi, relax, ok. But, yes. Eh, ¿Cuándo fue? Es, es, ah, ah, ¿Te adelantaste en la plataforma? ¿O era una tarea anterior? No, de hecho que sí, voy un poquito adelantada porque me no, gusta. No, pero it, it better for you. Mejor si van adelantaditos, ¿verdad? Pero, pero ahora ya, ya tenés como una idea, ¿ok? Pues sí, ya, vamos, ya vamos a ver eso, ¿ok? Con las preguntas. Eh, who else? Who else? You got, got this morning. Vaya. Mira aquí, Elsa. Los verbos no cambian, ¿ya viste? Ah, uh -huh. Porque el did... El did nos hace, nos ayuda a cambiar. Ya. Ok. Ya vamos a ver. Yo creo. Ya. Por eso les digo que en el, el, el pasado el negativo y la, la pregunta es fácil porque solo pones didn't o did y ya estuvo. Ok. Mm -hmm. eh, who's, who's next? Manuel. Manuel and Damari para darle la bienvenida. Ok. Number 14. Number, ok. How many times did you read? The book? Yes, 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 yes. How many times uh, did you read? Perfect. And Damali, 11, 11. Buenas, buenas. Hi, teacher. Good there. Sorry. Problem. Uh, number 11. Yes. I think I heard. Perfect. A strong. Sorry. Strange. A strange sound outside the door one minute ago. Yeah. Perfect, Damari. I heard, heard, okay. So, uh, to study again all of this. Okay, look at this. Solo en la, repito, solo en las afirmativas vamos a cambiar el verbo. Solo en las afirmativas. In, in negatives, es el didn't. Y in, in the questions, it's did. Como en el presente. ¿Se recuerda que en el presente las terceras personas se le agregan S en las afirmativas? Que gran dolor de cabeza. Kiss, kisses, cry, cries y todo eso. Pero en las negativas no se le agrega S. Solo le ponemos does, doesn't y es tú. Y en las preguntas le ponemos does y no le agregamos más S. ¿okay? Así que los auxiliares nos ayudan como a simplificar la vida. Así veamos. ¿okay? So el didn't y el did nos ayuda a ahorrarnos dolor de cabeza. For negatives. We're going to study more exa examples, okay, later. So, have you ever seen a traffic accident? Tell the anecdote, okay. 
So let's see if a person can tell. What about Mercy? Are you ready, Mercy? A short anecdote? Yes. Uh, okay, please tell. Me. Honestly, I don't know, remember having seen one. Mm -hmm. Only. Oh, okay, no. Fact? Solo, así como lo mencioné, solo, no en el momento preciso. After the accident. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. After yes. you, uh, okay. You watched uh, the scene, okay? Tu viste esto que se le llama. Uh -huh. La escena, okay? <laughs> the scene, yes. okay? Okay. Well, and that is something that is not good, right? You can see blood, you can see parts of bodies, yes. Okay, so thank you. Um, Let's listen now to Carmen Sira that she has seen a lot of trouble. So just select one, Carmen. Please. Uh, uh, no, bueno, I have never seen when it's happening, but at, at I the moment, mm -hmm. when it's yes. happening at the moment. Uh, I have had some minor ones. For example, I slower down because of the driver in front who in was front. going to cross and the driver behind crashing into me. Uh, so uh -huh. you were the victim. You were the victim yes. of the accident, the car crash. Yes, mm. teacher. Uh -huh. okay. Another time, it was a motorcycle. And on, Andrea, oh, uh -huh. <laughs> eh, 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 behind. Behind you. So the yes. motorcycle hit hit into you. The yes. Golpeo. Sí. Y todavía yeah. le tuvimos que pagar porque se raspó. What? <laughs> sí. Y el, uh, I was hide on the side by a drunk drive who was who was, who was drunk? You or the other person? No, teacher. No, the I'm other not. person. Ah, okay, the okay. Man. <laughs> really... <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, I, I guess, well, uh, that's really dangerous to drive or to ride motorcycle or whatever uh, vehicle drunk. Okay, that's, yes. that's not recommendable. Okay, please don't do that. Okay. So, well, Carmen, but after, well, after seeing or being witness of those accidents, uh, well, in the accident you were included, were, were not so, were the damage were not so high. El daño no, no fue tan alto. Not yet. No, no, not really. Okay. But that was unfortunately that you had to pay to that person if that person hit you. Hmm. Creo que en uno, el que me pegó atrás, el más afectado fue él. Maybe that, that was the reason, but as I know, como lo sé, the one that hits, the one that pays. El que pega, paga. Ay, That's teacher. what I know. But I don't Ay. know if any, any other, uh, anybody knows maybe a, a, a different form of solving that. La verdad que hasta lástima me dio, pero por mm. gusto ya después... Ha de ser difícil. Yo ya llegó la policía y todo, pero yo uno no creo que haya tenido como para poder pagar y dos no sé todo el proceso que se tenía que seguir yes, para uh, obligarlo. Yes, that's a long process and sometimes you yes. waste time. Desperdicias tiempo. You waste you waste time, energy, and maybe money, more money. So better not to continue with It's that. Dangerous. And yes, and dangerous. There are some people that they have some, yes, their attitude is really negative. Okay, yes, Carmen, yes. okay, thank you. Thank you for sharing that. And we go now with Charlie and then Edgar. Okay, Charlie. Okay, uh, the last year witnessed uh, the world sequence, sequence of a crash. Uh, uh, clearly drunk driver. Mm. Uh, the drunk, the drunk dri driver was riding a motorcycle or a car? Uh, or a car, a car. A car, okay. I noticed, I noticed it since, since it over, overlooked me by the mall of, I remember, Alta Vista. Uh -huh. uh, Breaking in a ratchet heavy way and almost uh, reaching maybe soya pango, yes, yes soya pango, uh, accelerated unexpectedly. Unexpected. 
unexpectedly. Mm -hmm. Unexpectedly. Five. Five syllables. Yes. Yes, yes. yes. Very nice. And, 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 and he two 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 cars. Two cars. Mm -hmm. He then accelerate in a positive direction. Opposite, and opposite direction. Opposite direction and finally crash it into the into a, a poste de luz hmm? power 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 pole. Power, power electric electricity. Uh -huh. and, and, and he el quedó. Okay. He, uh, she, ah, mm -hmm. He, yeah, he crashed. Mm -hmm. Or he, he was in the and he never nunca soltó el volante. He, uh -huh. he never took, took off. Como el de estoy agarrando señal. Así se había quedado. <laughs> ah, really? Okay, eh, he was. Todo, pero todo eso sucedió en eh, eh, ten, ten meters from me. Ten meters from you. And I guess it happened in a, in a couple of seconds, right? Yes, yes. Very, very, yeah. very fast. Very good. Very good. Okay. So, but at the end, he didn't die, right? No, no murió, right? Uh, no, no. Oh. But uh, uh, two person and car, uh, the, the, the woman, uh, she is... What's uh, lo, lo golpeó. More or less, but oh, yes. he is. Uh, ella estaba asustada. He was scared or in shock. He was in shock. I, 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 I pass uh, from from her and ask ask the ask he ask she if she was I, okay. She was okay, and, and she say yes. No me convenció, pero. But you, you, you maybe you saw her pale. La vista pálida. Maybe. Yes. Yes. People change the the color. Okay. Yeah. But yes, uh, there are there are some things that you see when you are driving or riding a motorcycle. You see a lot of accidents. Okay. Yeah. Oh, well, fortunately, uh, nobody was uh, well got hurt badly or nobody died. Okay. Thanks, Charlie and Edgar. We will continue. Uh, the last year uh, I was walking to take the bus mm -hmm. and that goes, goes to Metro Centro mm -hmm. and when I was ar arriving exactly at the corner suddenly uh, two cars collided uh, mm -hmm. and the truth was that the other one was moved a lot uh, they they on, they only got off the car and the girl who was going there was smart uh -huh. and took a picture uh, quickly uh, because the one who had hit uh, wanted to escape but when he noticed mm -hmm. he had no choice uh, but to wait for oh, the uh -huh. he could oh, that person couldn't escape right he <laughs> just yes, uh, uh, he no longer escape yeah well that that's good now the technology can be used for that in the past maybe that, that was uh, that was really difficult but now you can take pictures of the person you can take the, the id for that person to be responsible okay Thank you. A very interesting word that Edgar mentioned, collide. Collide is similar to hit, to crash, okay? Como la canción de Death Leopard, when love and, como es Marlon, when love and hate collide, right? Yes, teacher, when love, yes. And, when love and hate collide. Yes. A really nice, I recommend you, okay? Books and data. So nice. Okay, we continue. Thank you, Edgar, for that interesting, interesting, well, anecdote. Okay, now here we have. No me lo esperaba. Yeah, no, but. It, como si nada y de repente solo oí yes, el golpe. it happens in a couple of seconds. 
in a couple of seconds. But the person reacts, uh, some people react uh, like uh, suddenly, de repente reacciona la gente. Well, that, that's good. Okay, here we have uh, a mail uh, to Peter at uh, jmail.com. The subject complaint about a trip. Okay, complain sin la T es quejarse. Uh, it's a verb, okay? But complaint, pero con T significa queja. Okay, that's the, the, the only uh, difference. Complain sin la T significa quejarse. But complaint uh, es queja. Okay, to present a complaint. I, Okay, but when you say, I want to complain, si que no, no, me quiero quejar, because, blah, blah, blah. Okay, about a trip, about a trip, uh, it means a travel. So I uh, will need some of you help me read it. We're going to start with Claudia, please. Uh, Claudia, from line to line, okay? From here, Claudia, to here. And then we go with um, Kevin. Last week. Okay. Last way I had the chance to travel with your company to another country. Okay, thank you. Now, Kevin, and then we go with Helen. But, but to be honest with you, it was a bad experience because the rules that you assigned me in didn't have AC. AC. Okay, good. Uh, Helen, please. And then we go with Maritza. Mm -hmm. Was a long trip and the bus was very slow. Thank you. Okay, Maritza, I'm considering. I'm considering not traveling with you again because of the inconvenience I had. Inconvenience. Mm -hmm. the inconvenience. inconvenience. Okay, now the, this person, uh, is complaining about uh, this uh, the trip that, that he has. So now uh, I will need Susie to pick one of these questions and we're going to answer it. Okay. Mm, okay. Uh, number one, hmm? where did the passenger go? Where did mm. the passenger go? Okay. Maybe last week. Mm. Ah, perdón, perdón, perdón. Está Where? preguntando dónde. Yes, yes. Uh, yes. Mm, 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 mm. Ay, no sé, teacher. Tu corazón, ¿qué te dice? Está con sueño ahorita. No, me siento mal, teacher, por eso. Pero... Sí, el amor, así es, ok. A otra, ¿qué? A otra ciudad. No, another yes, country. another country. Yes, another okay. country. Yes. Eh, the, in the text, eh, it doesn't, eh, well, it is not a specific, the place. It just said uh, another country. Okay, now let's listen to um, Andrea, pick one. And mm -hmm. after this, we after Andrea, we go with Ellen Nielsen. Number two. Mm -hmm. Why did the passenger consider it a bad experience? Example. Okay, what could uh, it be? Because the boss does you assigned me didn't have AC. Okay, the, the, the short answer should be, the bus didn't have, the didn't have AC. That's it. okay. Yeah. Okay. So imagine a long trip, and maybe the windows are closed. Imagine uh, how the heat inside the bus. Uh, once I traveled from Esquipulas to Petén. When I was, I was 22 years old. I was a uh, backpackers. Backpackers uh, se le llaman a los mochileros. Backpackers, son las personas que van. I was a kind of hippie at that time. So can you imagine that? So I traveled 12 hours, 12 hours from Esquipulas in, in Guatemala to uh, Petén that was uh, in, well, I, I went to Tikal, okay? The Tikal, the, the pyramids. But uh, that trip was 12 hours in that bus, uh, had the, the, the windows closed and no AC. Can you imagine the heat? Si nos estábamos asando. We were boiling. Como dice, estábamos hirviendo, okay? So, uh, Eden Nilsson, we had number three. Okay, teacher. 
to until the passenger send the email. Um, ok, eh, yo creo que acá en lugar de what sería why. Uh -huh. Porque sería... Ah, uh -huh. Why, okay. bueno, pero aquí dice, but, but let's see, why the, did the passenger send the email? ¿Por qué envió el correo? The passenger. Because, what do you think? because the experience was bad. Was bad. For the bad service that uh -huh. they received. Yes. Uh, because exactly. the travel was very long in the trans transport. The, yeah, the transport. It, it doesn't have the best uh, conditions. Yes, that's it. And this person is, uh, uh, well, that person is not asking for a refund. No está pidiendo reembolso. Just complaining, right? Just complaining, right? Yes. Thanks. Okay. Now we continue with uh, this activity that it is speaking. Okay. The, the instruction says, Select an antonym. Okay, Charlie, do you remember what is antonym? Because we have synonym and we have antonym. Do you remember what is an antonym? It's the opposite. Yes, it's the opposite word because synonym is similar, right? Similar, but antonym is the opposite. Okay, for the underline of word, la palabra subrayada. Uh, in the sentences from the word bank. The word bank is esto. Este cual, bueno, es como un óvalo. Raro. Word bank is el banco de palabras. This, where you can see the words in blue. Write the antonym on the line. Okay? So for this, uh, we're going to start with Charlie and then we go with Marley. Okay? Okay. Uh, Alice is a quiet shop assistant. Uh, this is the, the, the sentence. Alice is a calm shop assistant. Okay, Alice uh, is a quiet shop assistant. Quiet yes. is calmadito, quietecito, tranquila. What uh, could it be the opposite? No, 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 okay. relax. Okay. Uh, give me time. Okay, you, you need time. Okay, that's it. Uh, what about Marlon? And then we go with Carmen. Number one. Okay. Bagel keeps a clean kitchen. Yep. And the antonym. Uh, should be filthy. Yeah, filthy. Mm -hmm. Como, yes, como creed of the field, como el grupo de, de black, yeah, Danny Field. Yes, yeah. Great field. Thank you, thank you, Marlon. Okay, we go with Carmen Sita, tell me, and then Maritza. Mm. Uh, okay, uh, number eight. Number Bill, eight. Billy's uh, boss was very rude to him. Okay. Uh, was very rude to him. He was very rude, very. Mm -hmm. Is it a it... calm teacher? Mm, do you consider that is calm the opposite? Mm -hmm. De ser pesado, ser calmado. Mm -hmm. mm, creo yo. Okay. Eso te dice tu corazoncito, Carmen. <laughs> it, eh, puede ser Polite? I guess it's polite. Okay. okay. Porque lo, lo contrario de, de ser rudo o pesado podría ser amable. Educado. Educado, okay. amable. Yes, that's it. Okay, polite. now let's. Yes, polite. Now uh, let's see. Maritza, and after Maritza, we're having Damari. In number two. Two. Baby always walks to work. In the morning is never. Okay, always is a frequency adverb, and we have uh, never, never. Yeah, very nice. Uh, we go now with uh, Damari and then Elsa. I'm not sure, but <laughs> relax, follow your heart. Number four. Four. 
those apples are round, mm -hmm. right? Okay. ¿Qué te dice tu, qué te dice tu, tu, tu corazón? <laughs> yeah, that's it. No dudes de, 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 de tu sentimiento, Tamari. Come on. Yeah, it's the it. word new. <laughs> yes. Uh, when we say row, uh -huh, es como, bueno, ripe es maduro. Okay. Mm -hmm. So row es como tiernecito. Okay. When we say uh, something that, that is not ready. Okay. okay. Por eso mm -hmm. también le decimos a la vez pasada, bueno, row puede ser como crudo, como en, como cuando no está procesado, ni nada de eso. ¿Se recuerdan de raw materials? De, de, de los materiales industriales de que estamos hablando. Ok. So, that was the last time. Ok. Uh, who's next? Me, teacher. Ok. Elsa, and then we go with Manuel. Number seven. Yeah. Harry was very nervous at the dentist. Mm -hmm. He's calm. Yes, calm. Even, I don't know if you like going to the dentist, but it is necessary. But I guess the people get nervous because of the sound. That, that, that sound it gets you very nervous sometimes. So that's it. Piensa que un Un drill. Yes. Thank you, Elsa, very nice. Manuel, and after Manuel, we have Carito. Okay, Manuel, are you there? Okay. okay. Yes, please. Uh, number nine. Yeah. And uh, Jill or Hill. Jill, yes. Como Jack and Jill. Mm -hmm. Jill has always been a shit person. Shy. Shy. Mm -hmm. I. Oh. Um. I think. Um. Gloomy. Gloomy, mm, okay. Shy is um, callado. Ah. Like me. Mm, uh -huh. That's right. Okay. Talk, talkative, algo así. Talkative. Yes, talkative. Talkative es como susi. Talkative, <laughs> hablan tina. Okay, nice. Uh, who else? Uh, Carito, right? Yes. And number three, when I was a child, I was careful with my toys. My toys. Toys. Uh, maybe closing. Yeah. Yep. 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 Okay. This is good, Carito. Who's who? Beatriz, are you there? Yeah. Okay, Bea is not ready. Okay, let's go with Mercy. And then number, number five. Five. My mother is ¿cómo se dice? Cheer, cheerful. Cheerful. When is rain? Rain. Uh, rain. Cheerful, como alegre, como emocionada. Sería gloom, gloom? gloomy. Mm -hmm. Gloomy. Yeah, gloomy, triste, como apagado. Yes, that's it. Thank you. Thank you, Mercy. Andrea. Then after Andrea, we're having Charlie, que no me dijo. Hmm? Teacher, uh, sure. number six. Yes. ¿Qué significa spread? Spread es regar. Okay. Oh. For example, you can spread. ¿Qué podrían regar? Mm, okay, when you are feeding the hens, cuando estás... Eh, alimentando a la gallina, yo spread rice. Tira okay. arroz, así. It's it. I guess is gather. Gather. Mm -hmm. Gather. Gather is collect. Spread, regar, gather. Can you? Eh, perdón. Can you spread the playing cards on the table? Yes, that's it. Good, thank you. On the table. Yeah, that's it. Okay, Charlie. Hmm? Uh, number three, really. When I was a child, I was careful with my toys. Oh, that and... was 
that was taken. Uh, your ta your was Alice. Alice in Chains. Creo que esa era la ah, tuya. Okay. Ya me la estaba cambiando, Charlie. Ajá. No, es que la vida es ocupada, como la vida la había tachado. <laughs> la vida. Okay. Okay. Yes, okay. Alice. Alice, uh, confident shop assist. Mm -hmm. A assist. confident. Mm -hmm. Confian eh, confianza, segura, but quiet. Como pues, un, un seguro, calmadito. Así como yo. Okay, so that's it. We continue. Have you ever seen the rain, Commission Credence? So here we go with Andrea. Tell me, and after Andrea, we're having Maritza. Okay, I never seen a traffic accident, but I was an accident, a motor, motorcycle accident. You were in the yes. accident, okay. Yes. Uh, I was riding in a motorcycle with my ex-boyfriend. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Continue. And we argued. Mm -hmm. And I, uh, nosotros íbamos. Yeah, we were going. We were going in the Los Chorros. Oh, yeah, Andre. Uh-huh. And then he lost control of the... Of the motorcycle. Uh, yes. Of the car. Ah, okay. No, motorcycle. And, I, and nos caímos. We fell down. Okay, we fell down and I slide for the highway. Te deslizaste. Slide. You yes. slide. The highway. And I... Me raspé, teacher. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I wanted, puede ser wanted, que te raspaste, te riste. I wanted my arm and my leg and my hand mm -hmm. and my shoe uh, fly in flow the highway. Away, flow away. Yes. Sal yes. Alero en aleta. Okay. <laughs> eh, Andrea, how was the speed? How was how much was the speed that you were going? Sixty. I, 60? I, I guess sixty. Uh huh. Yes, sixty, but really it's dangerous. Very, very fast. Yes, it's really fast. Imagine you could have been into into a, another car on the wall. Yeah. So, and por eso la terminaste. Sí. No. <laughs> Unfortunately, the cars, los carros que venían atrás de nosotros. Yes, the car behind you. Mm -hmm. eh, eh, they. They stop. Sí, they stop. Yes. They stop. Okay, very good. Because they could react and stop. Mm -hmm. Andrea, so you have nine lives. Tienes nueve vidas con un disco de Aerosmith. Okay. How, how long ago did that happen? Uh -huh. Three years ago. Wow. It was recent? Yes. Okay, thank you, Andrea. You have to be careful. Ya no pelear en el camino, espérate. You have to wait. And when you arrive to that place, you can have a discussion. I, I learned the lesson. Yes, you learned the lesson. That's the moral. La moral es. Okay, <laughs> uh, thank you, Andrea. Maritza, and after Maritza, we're, go we're having uh, Manuel. Um, yes, I I once had, had an accident. I passed and uh, I passed me a stop in a micro microbus yeah. was coming and hit my car to the right side. Oh, really? The the bus was full and two persons uh, fell into the bus. But uh, they hit hit. Se golpearon. Hit was not much, not much. Not much. Okay. Uh, however, okay. I gave money and one of them. Oh, the victims. Them. Oh, one of the the, the people in there. Yes. Really. And the other, <laughs> no, because. Uh, because um, they wanted to take advantage 
advantage. Quieren Advan aprovecharse. Advantage, yes. Advantage. And she say me that I had to pay llevar, llevar, to take, take, mm -hmm. to take, to take her at the uh, hospital, um, pri private hospital. Private hospital. And you private have to pay, hospital. you have to pay for that. Yeah. Yes. Uh, come on. Okay. <laughs> and I, I. You said no, right? No. You, you were not. No, and I no, no answered the phone more. Yes, of course. Okay. So thank you, Maritza. Yes, there are some people that they have always, uh, they want always to take advantage of some situation. There are some people that they need some help, of course, but there are some others that they don't. Oh okay. yes. Uh -huh. Okay. Thank you, Maritza. And we go, Manuel. Okay. Uh, no, teacher, I see the tree. Siempre que viajé hacia la universidad, me iba durmiendo. Oh, okay. You were, you, were, you were asleep. Okay, so no, no car crashes, no witness of car crashes. Okay. Thank you, thank you, Manuel. And let's listen to Susie. Okay, well, not a very serious one. Rather only a small collision or car crash between cars and motorcycles or buses and cars or similar. Okay, but nothing serious, right? Nothing serious, no, no, no. Oh, and were you involved in that car accident? Unfortunately, no. No, no iba peleando con nadie. No, no, no. Okay, so nice. It, it is good because uh, to be in that kind of uh, collision or accidents, it is stressful. For example, Carmen or, or, or maybe Andrea and Maritza, that they have been victims or they have been part of, of the accidents. It is stressful. Es estresante. And that uh, the rest of the days you are thinking about that. Van pensando el los siguientes días. Okay, it is not that good. Okay, thank you. Now here we have the best part. That's something that you, Susie, were talking about. Uh, that the use of did for questions. So uh, here we have this, and I will nail the pronunciation of mercy. Please uh, read all the questions. Information questions. What? What did you buy? Buy. Where, mm -hmm. Buy. Where did he fly to? Yep. When did we pay for the service? Service. How did they think out of the promotion? Okay. Find out. Thank you. Thank you, Mercy. Find out significa enterarse. I recommend you to write this phrasal verb. Este verbo sí. Anote lo. I recommend you because it's really common. You're going to see, find out in uh, a lot of uh, a lot of conversations or instructions or well, wh wherever, donde sea lo van a ver. Find out is darse en cuenta, darse cuenta. Amiga, date cuenta, similar a eso, okay? So este, find... Entonces, por ejemplo, en los, en los chats, eh, en el trabajo, por ejemplo, a mí sí, en el chat de trabajo me dicen, este, el proyecto tal ya se ya fue entregado uh -huh. y yo siempre pongo por ejemplo enterado enterado ajá. como ajá. copiado enterado a eso te refieres ah, enterado ajá y ahí sería como garit o garit uh -huh. garit garit uh -huh. así verdad sí sí ah, okay sí, sería así garit uh -huh. sí como okay. copiado enterado es, o puede ser understood Mm, entendido. entendido, entendido, entendido. Eso, pero understood es más formal, de hecho. Ok. So you can say it in that way. In, incluso en un correo se puede utilizar understood. Ok. Ok. Ok, perfect. And so find out is similar to realize and notice. Es similar como a darse cuenta, notar, ¿verdad? Incluso como averiguar también. So, how did they find out of that promotion? ¿Cómo se dieron cuenta? ¿Cómo averiguaron de esa promoción? Okay, so here we have short answers. And for short answers, I will need Claudia Diaz, okay? I bought, I bought. 
I bought a vacation package. 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 Uh, he flew. He, he flew to another country. Okay. We pay. We pay for the service last month. They found. Found out. Found out. They found out about it on internet. Se dieron cuenta en el internet. Pero lo encontraron. Okay. So that's it. Easy. In las preguntas, in the questions, you are going to use did and the verb in the normal form, okay? But in the short answers like this, you're going to, well, you're going to see that we have the verbs in the past, and these are irregular verbs because they change. Sabemos que comprar se dice buy, but in the past, bought. Uh, in present, we see, we say fly, volar, but they say flu, okay? So uh, here we have some uh, exercises. So we're going to create some questions. Think about one of these questions. What did you, how did you, why did you, where did you, who did you? We can use some of these uh, equations or formats, okay? But these are. And for this, I will need Marlon to help me. And then I will need um, Jasmine. You can say uh, about what, okay? About um, sorry. Yes, okay. The, the instruction says complete the email using prepositions of time. Okay, imagine that these are questions for an email, but if not, you can use some other verbs. Okay? To create it's my turn. questions. No, Marlon first, and then you go, just okay? Ah, okay. <laughs> sorry. Relax. Okay. Uh, uh, puede ser cualquier. Yeah, whatever, whatever. What, what matters is that you can use this, okay? Okay. Um, pre, Remember, las the verb is in present. El verbo que es normal, okay? Mm -hmm. Pero las preposiciones of time, ¿cuáles son, teacher? Y lo de... Okay. Uh, prepositions of times. Uh, last month. Yesterday, mm. last year, last night. Esas son las preposiciones de tiempo porque se, se relacionan en cuándo fue. Ok. Ok. So, last year, last month, last, last night. Ok. Three years Exacto. ago, four years ago. Ok. Uh, what did you do yesterday in the office? Yeah, perfect. What did you do yesterday? ¿Está bien así? Or what yes. did you do in the office yesterday? No, what did you do? Eh? And what did you do in the office mm -hmm. yesterday? That's it. Okay. okay. Or you can say, what, what did you do yesterday in the office? But normally, the adverbs va both at the beginning or at the end. Como yesterday okay. es un adverbio, al inicio o al final. Okay. Thank you, Jasmine. And then we go with uh, Andrea. Number four. Where did you go last year? Yes, where did you go last year? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Uh, Andrea and Damari, que se me está escondiendo. What did, what did you eat dinner? What did you eat for dinner? For or dinner. at dinner? Mm -hmm. okay. Thank you. Uh, Damari and Carmen. What did you see on the mall? <laughs> what did you see on the mall mm -hmm. yesterday, uh, last week? That's it. Carmen and then Maritza. Okay. Where did you eat last weekend? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Uh, Maritza, mercy. Uh, number five. Who did you is who did you this work? Mm -hmm. Who did you? Necesitamos el verbo después de you. Mm -hmm. Who did you do? Who did ser? you do? Yes. Who did you do the, this work uh, this morning? This morning, yes. Okay. If we are in the afternoon, we can say, who did you do this yes. work? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Thanks, Marta. Merci. And then after Mercy, we're having Charlie. 
Uh, I creo que no tengo ni una de ahí, teacher. Uh, when do you run? Where did you run? ¿Dónde corriste? Sí. Eso se escucha como reclamo. Ok. Charlie, we finish with you. <laughs> ok. Uh, uh, maybe... Who did you... Who did you think won yesterday? Who did you... Who did you think mm -hmm. won? 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 Won yesterday. Ah, ¿quién crees que ganó ayer? Okay. Yes. Nice. Thank you. Okay, here we have a worksheet. And this is really particular. We're going to use when, how, who, what, and why for the question. So uh, we're going to have very clear this. Remember that you can repeat when, how, who, what, why, okay? Because there are some of, of, of these sentences we have from one to 10. And we're going to start with Carmen. And after Carmen, we're having um, Kevin. Number seven, teacher. Yes. Uh, first, I need you to read the sentence and then we go with, with the other, okay? I eat an apple pie. I ate. I, I ate. ate an apple pie. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Entonces sería what? Yes. Kind of did you eat? What kind? What kind, Carmen? What kind of pie did you eat? Yes. No dudes, Carmen. No dudes de ti. Okay. What kind of pie did you eat? Uh, who's next? Hi, teacher, Kevin. Okay, Kevin, and after Kevin, Edgar. But I'm not ready. Okay, not... take your time. Edgar, what about you, my friend? And then Helen. Number um, ba, 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 two. Okay, I got I up. Got up at seven o'clock. Hmm? What time did you get up? Perfect, what time? Nice. Helen and then Carito. Number three. Mm -hmm. She still. She paid. Mm -hmm. She paid ten dollars. Ten dollars. Um. How much did she pay? How much did she pay? Nice. Okay, Carito, and then Elsa. And number nine. Mm -hmm. They were to Helen. They were to Helen. And sería who? Who? Mm -hmm. who? Who did who did they write to? Mm -hmm. Who did they write to? Nice. Okay, Elsa, and then we go with Beatriz if if she's ready. Okay. Number number eight. Number eight. Okay, no te la van a dar todo. Okay. Who did you play tennis? I play tennis. I Wimbledon. play tennis last week. Mm -hmm. I went play tennis last week. Mm -hmm. When did you play mm -hmm. tennis? Yes. When. Sí, porque eh, si te das cuenta, es subrayada la semana pasada. So, when. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And Bea, are you ready, Bea, or do you need time? Yes, teacher. Uh, yes. Number, number four. Okay, he. Number four, he didn't like the movie and didn't, didn't he like the movie? Mm, no. No, hay que elegir cualquiera de estos. Ah, perdón, perdón, ya entendí. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ah, when... Okay, a él no le gustó la película. ¿Mm? Ah, uh, why? Y es why. ¿Por qué no le gustó why? la película? Uh -huh. Thank you. Está enamorada de TV. Okay. And... <risa> mm, okay. Sí, es la... Es el... Wait, es la... Uh, who's next? Nobody, right? So let's go with the Mari. Que está enojada. Yeah. Me las quitaron. Así Así es la vida. Y Kevin, a Kevin, que todo. Después va Kevin. Ajá. 
Siempre debes eh, tener eh, muchas opciones, Damari. Eh, number six. Yeah. The meeting finish, finished late. Ajá. Uh -huh. when, when time did, did the meeting finish? When. When time did the meeting finish? ¿Cómo dices a qué horas? Ah, ok. <laughs> Ah, uh, what? Yes. How? No, what? What, what, what? What time? Yes, teacher. I'm sorry. What time did the meeting finish? Thank you. Kevin. Ya, yeah, si te la ganaron, mira. <laughs> okay, number five. Five. We have dinner. Uh, so, um, when? Mm -mm. No. What? Yes, what? Mira, te te la gana. Yeah, what? <laughs> what did you have for dinner? Yes, yes, yes. Thank you. Let's go with. Vaya, Claudia, ya que estás animada. Dale. <laughs> Después va a echarle. Porque, porque lo que pasa es que a las 5 era la que yo tenía preparada. Ah, ni modo. Después va a echarle. Ajá. <laughs> ah, mejor yo primero. <laughs> <laughs> nada, nada. Hay que aprovechar. No, no, no. <laughs> Ay, ni I se la puede poner, digo yo. <laughs> ok. Ajá, I didn't. I didn't eat the chicken. Ajá. Sería. What? What? Charlie, ¿tú qué dices? Va, va. Ya ve, ya ve. I didn't eat the, the, the chicken. Why didn't? Yeah. Yes. yes why didn't? Why, why didn't you eat the chicken? Okay. Vaya, casi. And to finish, Andreita, porque está sufriendo sobre todo. Va, Andreita. Number okay. one. They wanted to see Fiona. That's right. Uh -huh. who, who did they want to see? Who did they want to see? Okay, thank you. Okay, we're going to create questions. Marlon, you are the first, and then we go with Carmen. Okay, create questions based on the words that you can see in parentheses, in their brackets, okay? We're going to do it. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay, I think uh, number one can be, what did you eat last Monday? Perfect, Carmen, then Maritza. When did you see that film? Perfect. Maritza, um, Jasmine. Um, how did you come here? Yes, Jasmine and Beatriz. Uh, when, uh, um, you need time? Yes. Okay, okay, no problem. Bea, are you all right? Then Manuel. Okay, Bea, I guess Bea is not ready. Manuel, what about teacher, you? Solo, teacher, solo voy a cambiar de dispositivo. Okay, okay, go ahead. Para encender la cámara porque no me funciona. Okay, okay, go ahead, Bea. Um, Manuel, please. Okay, esperamos a... A ver. No, dale. Qué <laughs> bueno. Solo, solo de gentleman. Uh, number four. Qué manera mal. Why? Why he take my book? Why? Te falta el no. auxiliar. ¿Cuál es el? What is the auxiliar? La verdad no no puse mucha atención. Estaba en otra cosa. Okay. Why did he? Say, okay, my book. Okay, did el did siempre está presente en sus corazones. Eh, now let's see Charlie and then Claudia. Uh, number nine. Hmm? Uh, how much did did cut this dress? Ah, uh, how much did this? Did uh, okay. Did okay. this dress cost? Ah, el sujeto aquí es this dress. Bien confusa esta verdad. Uh, sí, sí, por eso tenía mi duda. Ok. This dress es como que dijeras you, she y todo esto, ok? Ese es el sujeto. 
Thank you. Okay, Claudia and Helen. Okay. Why, why did you say that? Why did you say that? ¿Por qué dijiste eso? Thank you. Helen. After mm -hmm. Helen, we're having Edgar. I'm ready. Okay, I'm ya te la están friend. ganando, Yasmin. Okay, Helen, go ahead. I'm yes. ready for you. This? I'm sorry, Helen. Could you repeat it again, please? Sorry. Number 10. Yep. How many friends did he meet yesterday? Perfect, Helen. Okay, Jasmine. Para que no te la gane, Edgar. Porque ella va con todo. <laughs> Number eight. Mm -hmm. what, what time did the rain leave? The train leave. Thank you. Excellent. Edgar and Mercy. Mm, okay. Number seven. Mm -hmm. uh, where did Jane go on holiday last month? Perfect. Yeah. That's the way. Mercy. Show time. Number six, mm -hmm. when did they en enter mm -hmm. through the window? Through, through. Through mm -hmm. the window. Yes, break on through to the other side. Okay, through is a través de. Okay, thank you, Mercy. Very nice. Ya están listos para la vida. Okay, yeah, perfect. You don't have problems with the question. Ya no tiene problemas con las preguntas existenciales, ¿verdad, Carmencita? Todos lo saben. Have you ever seen the rain? Let's see, with this, we're going to start with who? What if we go with Edgar? Edgar. Teacher. Okay, and then Elsa. Teacher. Yeah? Ya pasé. Ah, es cierto, pero no sé por qué no te puse. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Elsa and then Damari. Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. Ready? Uh, several, several accidents. Several accidents. Mm -hmm. I see almost the, uh, every day. Almost every and, day. And we came for, because um, of the location of your work. Yeah, yes, I, I live in, in the planets. I me traslado hasta Antiguo Cucatlán. Yes. So yes. Um, the, the street is very... So, it, yes, yeah. it, it is dangerous. And yes. uh, it yeah. is very common for you So to, to, to see accidents. Más que yo agarro el desvío a Huizuca. Okay, me too. I, I, I use that, that road too. Okay. Pues de, una vez, no sé cómo decir, bueno, le quiero contar mi experiencia del accidente donde yo estuve. Ok. Um, the um, truck that hit my brother's car. Mm -hmm. um, uh, ¿Cómo se dice? Golpeo, right? Hit. Mm -hmm. Crash. Hit in the next to where I was going. Ah, oh, ok. In that side, en ese lado. Yeah, yes. Um, me, um, digo, pero que no sé pronunciar esta palabra. Injured. Injured. Mm -hmm. Y como es, right? In my leg. Oh. Uh -huh. <clears throat> so I. Llegó la ambulancia. The ambulance came. Y, yeah. Entonces, vieron que yo tenía un shock nervioso y todo eso, y dijeron que no tenía nada. Pero en eso llegó mi suegro, que él es médico, y me dice, hija, salite, salite. Y cuando me sacan, me había quedado atrapado un hierro en mi pierna, porque se había caído el bajavidrio. Y de ahí donde salió el chorro de sangre, <ríe> y me tuvieron que llevar a la... A la a hospital. Ok. De ahí, ahí... For few weeks, For... I use, I use, eh, no encontré bien la palabra eh, bastón, ok. Mm -hmm. Bastón, no, no utilizaste muleta. No, solo el bastón. Pero me tuvieron que operar, me tuvieron que abrir otra vez porque se me infectó. 
Así sí. que estuve incapacitada más tiempo. Mm. Pero sí, yeah. es el tráfico horrible aquí en Los Palos. Ok, yes. Ok, so you used like a walking stick, también puede decirlo. Ok, and yes, it is, uh, well, that's really dangerous because you yes. have had, uh, you could have lost your leg or your feet, foot, pues haber perdido hasta el pie, that, that happens sí. sometimes. Ok, mm -hmm. Elsa, uh, I'm happy that, and we're happy that mm, you are. Y yo ya me dijo más lento también, también se yes, aprende por tiempo. No sé, yes, it no is better. Yes, it is better. No sé por qué me gustaba manejar rápido. Yeah, nobody knows when a, an accident can happen. Ok, to you. Yes. So thank you, yes. thank you, thank you for sharing your hard experience. Now, Damari, and after Damari, we're having Kevin. Hi, teacher. So, my anecdote is sad. <laughs> okay. I won't put your... uh, one year ago, mm -hmm. when I went to to beach, I saw I saw on the street a uh, Eh, que golpeó un carro. A uh, 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 car hit. A car hit. A cow. Una no, vaca. Okay, a cow. Yes. So, the cow is suffering. Was suffering. Was suffering. Someone eh, gritó. Someone shouted. Okay, shouted. Someone shouted. Uh, give the the sniff. The, the sniff. The, 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 the yes. Kill. Yes. Uh, kill the the cow. Kill the cow. You. So, you kill so, the cow. No, I saw. Ah, you saw. Okay. Uh, so, uh, kill the cow. After that, all the people uh, give give a piece piece. Agarrando una pieza. <laughs> oh, God. So they were cutting the cow. They yes, were cutting the cow. So the cow. many, many. Oh, era lo más rápido que podían hacer para quitar el la vaca de. ¿Y qué te trajiste? No, la costillita. Only ice ay, ay, de... Lomito, lomito. No. Pasó no. tomando su padre. Sí, de sopón, sopón, de re. No, because it's sad, teacher. Okay, no. yeah, poor cow. Yes, poor Pero... cow. Oh. The deep, the, the, the deep cow is worth more. Yes. Yes. Okay. Bueno, sabemos que queda Mari. Sí, sí, queda Mari. No, estaba... only she was teacher, me. you tell me the anecdote. Okay, I... yes, the anecdote, sí. A partir de ahí, da Mari puso una carnicería cerca de su casa. So now <laughs> she's a businesswoman. She no, she's teacher, I cry. <laughs> ah, okay, I'm sorry. Yes, poor old cow and... Yeah, animals uh, don't have, they, they are not guilty. No son culpables, they are just walk. Okay, so the person who is driving has to be very careful with that, with those kind of animals. Okay, and that happens. The, the animals walk on the street in uh, Comalapa. More, yeah. more the animals. Yes, yeah, so... And people don't, don't, don't take care. They, they speed up, aumentan la velocidad. They speed up and they go. But yeah. And even it is care, it is dangerous because if you hit a cow and you can go and you can, yeah, slide and go to, to you, you, can you can crash or hit in another part. Okay. Thank you, Damari. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry for you. Kevin, what about you? Okay. The one I remember the most is of a boy who was riding a motorcycle. Mm -hmm. And I think that he was driving in the opposite direction. Oh, okay. como el contrario. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Trying to, trying to, como de rebasar. No sé si. Yes, mm -hmm. speed up. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, yes. The other cars in the course of the de los naranjos. No, no. Ah, yes, yes. Okay. Yes. 
Wow, so he was already dead. Ya, ya había fallecido. No sé, no sé. Creo que era reciente porque no se miraba tanta gente ni nada así por el estilo. Ok. Well, for him. Well, and in that way, in that road, it, it is lonely. A veces tanto solitaria esa calle. So that's why you have to be like careful. Ok. Uh, thank you. Thank you, Kevin, for, for sharing. And just two words. Injured is herido. Wounded también es herido. Ok. Overtake es sobrepasar y speed up es aumentar de velocidad. Speed up, ¿verdad? Acelerar. Si quiere chocar. Okay, you, can say, hold, you can say hit, you can say eh, crash, and you can say collide. Y en pasado, crash. Yes, crash. Yes, crash. It's a regular verb. Y collide. Y collide. Collided. Mm -hmm. Collided. Yeah, hit es un verbo irregular. Este no cambia. Puede ser hit es el mismo. Es como put, no cambia. Ok. So nice. Uh, now we have 13 minutes. 13 minutes. Overtake. Perdón. Overtake es sobrepasar. Overtake. Speed up. Speed up es acelerar, aumentar. Ok. Hay una parte de, de la canción de Patience de Guns N' Roses dice Mama said uh, you can speed up the time. Mamá decía que no podías acelerar el tiempo. Algo así dice. Ahí me aprendí esa palabra, speed up. Ay, esa canción es buena. Ok, and we're going to the listening part. Vamos a, a la parte de eso. Bueno, no sé si estamos copiando las palabras, pero injured, herido, wounded, igual. Eh, si quieren decir solo herida, se dice wound, wound. Ok, eso les es herida. Overtake, sobrepasar, speed up, eh, acelerar, eh, hit, crash, and collide. Eh, es chocar, golpear, eh, colisionar. Okay. So, now let's go to the listening part. I need, oh, I'm sorry. I can't see that. Okay, be mm -hmm. ready with the. This is uh, this is like uh, a minute audio. So let's listen to it. Vamos a escuchar. I'm sorry. Is this the stormy weather played its part I'm going to in the player play again? Golf and today was the first day's play in the IBM Open in Tennessee. Stormy weather played its part and the players didn't tee off until around two o'clock in the afternoon. Once play did get underway, the Australian Mark Chappell played some superb shots and finished the day on five under par 67. Two shots clear of Mark McGonagall from Scotland and the local boy Chav Connor shot of the day. However, went to the unknown Canadian Rose Wirter, who made an unbelievable hole in one on the short 12 hole. Wirter held his head in his hand as his wayward shot seemed to be heading for the lake, but it miraculously hit a wooden post, bounced back onto the green and into the hole to the delight of the capacity crowd. Then again, Golf and today was the first day's play in the IBM Open in Tennessee. Stormy weather played its part and the players didn't tee off until around two o'clock in the afternoon. Once play did get underway, the Australian Mark Chappell played some superb shots and finished the day on five under par 67. Two shots clear of Mark McGonagall from Scotland and the local boy Chav Connor. Shot of the day, however, went to the unknown Canadian Rose Wirter, who made an unbelievable hole in one on the short 12 hole. Wirter held his head in his hand as his wayward shot seemed to be heading for the lake. 
Okay, I'm sorry. I guess uh, this realidad se murió esto. Okay. This is the last part. Held his head in his hand as his wayward shot seemed to be heading for the lake, but it miraculously hit a wooden post, bounced back onto the green and into the hull to the delight of the capacity crowd. Okay, so uh, let's see what are some words that you remember. So for this, uh, maybe Carmen, do you remember one word? Uh, until around two o'clock in the afternoon. Okay, good. Two o'clock in the afternoon, very nice. And uh, what about Charlie? Do you have another? Uh, to set clear of, yes. Uh-huh. I don't remember the name. Uh, of, of the person. Yes, yes, two, two, two set clears. Okay. okay, thank you. What about the man? Um, who make, I don't believe it. Okay. Nice. Uh, Bea? Uh, two o'clock in the afternoon. Okay, está copiando. Thank you. Andrea? Mm -hmm. Stormy weather place in Por algo así. Okay, nice. Uh, what about Maritza? Mm. We heard from Scotland and the cowboy. How may unbelievable? I don't. Okay, okay, yes. Uh, I guess it was kind of weird, uh, this audio. And uh, Marlon, do you remember uh, any phrase? Uh, no, I just two o'clock, two o'clock in the <laughs> afternoon. I just remember. Yes, yes, okay. I guess that, that was kind of difficult. Carmen and Charlie. Carmen. Yo pasé teacher, pero tengo ABA opening. Ah, uh -huh. okay. ABA opening. Me, me gusta porque está de creativa, Carmencita. Me está agregando letras. Good. <laughs> It's an opening. Charlie and Edgar. Charlie. Uh, again, um, ATP open. Mm, okay. Thank you. Sí, había pasado, Charlie. I'm sorry. Edgar, and then listen. I'm going to listen. Okay, alcancé a escuchar Dead Place in Tennessee, eh, Doug McGonagall, eh, His Hair in His Hand, As We Work, y Compacity Pro. Okay, very nice. You remember those uh, names. Thank you. Okay, uh, we're going to check uh, this audio and we were, we're going to be about to finish. Okay, so listen. Golf and today was the first day's play in the IBM Open in Tennessee. Stormy weather played its part and the players didn't tee off until around two o'clock in the afternoon. Once play did get underway, the Australian Mark Chappell played some super shots and finished the day on five under par 67. Two shots clear of Mark McGonagall from Scotland and the local boy Chuck Connor shot of the day. However, went to the unknown Canadian Rose Wirter, who made an unbelievable hole in one on the short 12 hole. Wirter held his head in his hand as his wayward shot seemed to be heading for the lake, but it miraculously hit a wooden post, bounced back onto the green and into the hole to the delight of the capacity crowd. Okay, very good and now to finish because now here we have like what five minutes tenemos cinco minutos and let's see the song a quien le toca la canción 
who was Mediator, okay. okay, so you can share what I compartir. Okay. Is esta. Okay. Okay. You tell me, think about it. Well, I did. Now I don't want to feel a thing anymore. I'm tired of paying for the things that I want. I'm oversleeping like a dog on the floor. Oh, oh, interesting. Does anybody know this song? Any conoce esta canción? Hmm. No, I guess nobody. Charlie, you? No, teacher. No, okay. Uh, Kevin? Okay. A singer um, or a band? Okay. It's the Pierce the Bale with Kellen Quinn. King for a day. Mm, really well. Honestly, I don't know it. But okay, show us the the, the birds or no había entendido muy bien, teacher, pero... Ok, the regular birds. I, um, told? Yeah, told. Told. Did. Mm -hmm. eh, bueno, los regulares... Is it tired? Okay. Okay. A guana is guant. Mm -hmm. And maybe you, you can you can uh, say one personal pronoun, one or two personal pronoun. Shall be you. You. Uh huh. And what other could it be? I. Okay, you and I. Yes, that's it. Okay, very nice. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you, Kevin. Mm -hmm. We are about to finish and we have some people that didn't uh, give the opinion. For example, Claudia, Carito, Helen, Marlon, Jasmine, and Bea. So tomorrow, Tomorrow you're going to be the first one, okay? Mañana nos cuentan ustedes sobre los accidentes porque ya estamos terminando, okay? Se nos fue un poquito el tiempo. So, um, solo no, nos faltaron ustedes. But I'm going to check the attendance. Hola, Bea. Lo de ayer y lo de, lo de ahora y lo de mañana. Sorry. Vamos a hacer doble. Sí, pero cortita. No. cortita no. no. Vaya. Le voy a dar para que elijan una, ¿vale? ¿Te parece? A ver, yo que reclamo. Ok, teacher. Ah, ahí sí, ¿verdad? Ahí sí, ¿verdad? Ok, um, so you tell me if you are here, ¿verdad? Lo que pasa es que ahí nos emocionamos con la, con la red de Damari. Ok, so um, tell me if you are there. Merci. I don't know. ¿Cómo es? No vuelvo a contar nada. ¿Cómo no, hombre, no, Mari, es parte del show. Pero mira, ya te quito el sueño. A ver. No llores, hombre, te queremos. We love you. Ok, Mercy se me fue para la party. Ok, Andrea. I'm here. Present teacher. Ah, ok, ya ves. Ay, no, Mari, ya vos. Chérate que te cuenten las otras pasadas de los tacos. No, mejor I nada. don't tell you, teacher. Never. No, pero la clase sí, ¿verdad? Por the other year. Okay, uh, Charlie. Uh, I'm here, teacher. Thank you, Carmen. Sit up. Present, teacher. Thank you, uh, Claudia. Present, teacher. Hi, Carito. Present. Hi, Maritza. Present. ¿Qué pasa, vea? Está llorando, vea, mire. Porque no pasó, dice, porque no le sucedió. Tranquila. Okay, uh, Ede. And it's all. Present. Thank you, Edgar. Good night. Good night, Elsa. Present teacher. Good. Damari, the most innocent girl in the world. Present. Thank I you. never in the life. 
Come on, Damaris. Relax. Fue parte del show. Helen. Present teacher. Thank you, Kevin. Present. Nice. Eh, Manuel. Present. Nice. Marlon. Present. Susie, thank you. Jasmine. Present. Fair. Present. Okay, thank you. Eso sí se fue. Ay, Damari, bueno, sabe cómo me molesta, Karen, con mis vecinas. So, see you tomorrow. Remember that we have six more classes, solo seis clases más y ya vamos a terminar, ¿ok? Eh, creo que Las Kevin... melcochas, teachers. <laughs> yes, the melcochas. Ok, malo lo que me cita. Ok, so, Kevin, ahora te toca, ¿verdad? Bueno, te toca el viernes. Yes, Kevin, so, the rest, see you tomorrow. Bye, bye, descansen. Bye, bye. See bye. you. Okay, um, we were expecting to have a, a student for the 10 minute session. Unfortunately, uh, he couldn't uh, be here connected. So I'm going to have a short review about the class. Number 14, simple past information equations. This is the class number 14. Uh, the course is beginners four. So um, in specific, we have this mail. It is a complaining mail related uh, to uh, a journey that a person has uh, it was a service provided for a, for a company. And the customer uh, was, uh, well, the customer detailed some of the inconvenience he uh, had in this journey. So uh, the person who was submitted to this uh, email is Peter, at gjmay.com. The subject is complain about the trip and the person who sends this uh, email has this uh, the, this email address hr.r at jmail.com. It says like this. Last week, I had the chance to travel with a uh, your company to another country. But to be honest with you, it was a bad experience because the bus that you assigned me in didn't have AC. It was a long trip and the bus was very slow. I am considering not traveling with you again because of the inconvenience I have. Taking into account uh, this email, now here we have uh, some questions to be answered related to their reading above. So the activity three says, ask a different partner these questions and write the answers. We have three questions. So let's go with number one that it says, where did the passenger go? Um, here in the text, uh, it doesn't establish or detail, give details related to the the place in specific, but it says 
uh, travel with your company to another country. There's no specifications related to the, the end of the journey. It just says another country. Now here we have number two. Why did the passenger consider it a bad experience? Example. So the reason why the passenger was complaining, um, there were two reasons. One is that the bus assigned didn't have a C. So we can imagine that the travel or the journey was very long and the weather or the, or the environment was not comfortable. And the other situation, it, it's that, well, it establishes that it was a long trip and the bus, the bus was very slow. So can you imagine how many hours and this, this uh, journey took? What did the passenger say in that email? Obviously this passenger or the customer was complaining related to the service provided by this company. After this, we have uh, this uh, grammar chart in which uh, we can see the different forms to create a question and to answer it. The information questions are, what did you buy? The short answers are, I bought a vacation package. Number two, where did he fly to? The answer is he flew to another country. Number three, when did we pay for the service? The answer, we paid for the service last month. And number four, how did they find out of that promotion? Number four, they found out about it on internet. After this, we have uh, this um, these uh, sentences and specific questions where uh, we can see uh, there are uh, the initial phrases or word to create the questions. What did you, two, how did you, three, why did you, four, where did you, five, who did you? Okay. And so the questions can it be, uh, for example, what did you buy? That is one example. Two, where did he fly to? Number three, when did we pay for the service? And how did they find out the promotions? Related to that, we have some examples how to create some questions using WH questions so the students can have more practice about this topic. 